What's going on Plan Army? Jacob here and welcome to another one of my Photoshop tutorials. Alright, so today I just wanted to show you a few ways to make a photo. It doesn't really matter what it's about or I mean what's in the photo. It could be a sunset. That's what I'm using for my example. Um, I'm going to show you how to make things look good in Photoshop with image adjustments. So they can be find image adjustments and then there'll be these first four here. Brightness slash contrast, levels, curves, and exposure. So, but instead of going into image adjustments and applying them here, like you can, you can just grab curves, drag it down, and it looks nice. But then, say you want to change what you did. If you go back to image adjustments curves, then you can't change it back to what you had before. So instead of doing that, what I recommend is adding a adjust an adjustment layer from down here in the bottom right, and then you can choose them here. And that's what I've done, and so the first one I'll show you is curves. You can see here it's just a sunset, but then when you add the curves, it just looks amazing. You can double click here now and edit the curves. I dropped down the blacks over here and brought up the brightness over here to lighten up the sky. And you can always go back and change it now. So there's that. And exposure just kind of enhances the effect of curves. So if you go in there, you can mess with the exposure. It makes it kind of like brighter all around, more luminescent. Offset, it, like it's almost like levels or like brightness. You want to keep that down or else it kind of looks washed out like this. So it looks nice if you have it low down. And gamma correction just like it make it's kind of like exposure except it brightens things up a little bit more. So it looks nice if you have it around like I have it at like 0 0.7, 0 0.8. So here you can already see with these two on, it's a huge difference. And it makes your photo look really nice. So next I'm going to do levels. And I know it's a really subtle change, but what levels does is it's almost like brightness, but it, um, it chooses how um, intense the whites and blacks are in your photo. So if you bring up, or if you lighten the blacks basically, because it's the level of the blacks, then it looks really washed out. So you're going to want to keep that all the way down usually. But if you bring the whites darker though, that kind of creates a more softer sunset -y look for this photo. So I'm going to drop that down. And then brightness and contrast, of course, is brightness and contrast. It's sort of self-explanatory, but you can bring up the brightness and it like emphasizes the sky and it looks really nice that way. But not too much because or else all of it looks a little uh, the same color. And I brought down the contrast a little bit, but contrast doesn't have that much of a difference unless you bring it really high and then you can see it looks almost flamey in the top of the sky. The edges kind of become sharp and fiery, so I'm going to keep that low down. So there we have it. I changed this sunset into this really intense color looking sunset. So that's just what I wanted to show you guys, some image adjustments in Photoshop. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.